Okay, today we're going to work on a pose that really helps improve Baddha Konasana and also strengthen the arms and the shoulders and the wrists. Um, this is using the wall as support. So um, we have a few videos of the poses to do before this one and then um, here we go. So first, when you sit in Baddha Konasana, right, usually you can use a little height underneath your um, sit bones depending on how um, tight your hips are or how far down you can bring your legs. So if you are here in Baddha Konasana or if you're here, if you can bring the legs down or if the knees touch the ground, that's going to be um, something to take into consideration for this pose. And there also shouldn't be any pain in the knee. So we're going to start. So come over to the wall and you sit really close to the wall here and you measure where your shoulder height is on your wall. So mine is about right at the top of these metal plates here. I'm gonna keep that in mind. And then I'm going to uh, show you all the different variations. So we can start out, and when I do this pose on the floor, I don't want to use a sticky mask because I want my knees to be able to, to feel free to come apart. So I can use but if I'm on a wooden floor, this works best. So I can start out putting a blanket um, and leaving it wrinkled in the center. All right. I grab a bolster and I put the bolster here so I can lay on the bolster. So I, I bring my feet to the wall and I'm gonna bring my feet so that the toes are pointing outwards like this. So Toes are pointing outwards, and I rest here, like this. Right, so it's kind of a frog position where my feet are on the wall and I'm supported by the bolster. And this would be really good if you're very tight in Bhagakonasana, when I showed you when the knees are coming up above the hips, then you can use the bolster, you can add more height so that this part, uh, you know, the, the hip here starts opening. Right? And as I work more here, I can remove the height and I can work here. If there's any pain in the knee, make sure that the skin of the knee, I'll show you that when you do this, that the skin of the knee doesn't go in. Right, You always want that rotation of the skin of the knee to come out like this. So it's an outer rotation of that skin. So if when you're coming here, if this, that skin, the movement of the skin is going in towards the inner leg, use your hand, scoop that skin, and roll it out. Okay, so you work here for a while. Come up carefully. And then I'll show you the progression of different things that you can do after this one. So now we're going to use this height here that we measured of the shoulder. I'm going to come up onto my, with my arms um, straight. Okay, so hands, um, hands and wrists are right below the, the shoulder, so I don't have my hands extended out or too narrow. I have them shoulder width apart. And I bring my feet out like this. Right. <laughs> so here I come and I try to lift the knees. <laughs> And I'm pretty tight on my hips, but you can come into Baddha Konasana here with your feet out. If that's too difficult, you can support your feet with the blocks. And you can work like that. Okay, so you bring your foot here. And you work like that. And then I would need to bring them further apart. Come. Okay. So you can strengthen that. Step two, you would come on your forearms and at the height of my forearm here is about the halfway point in between the two middle plates. So I'm going to place my feet right here. So come here. Okay, and then work on your Baddha Konasana here. Okay. 
And then the third variation would be facing up. So you do facing up at all levels with the arms straight and uh, on your forearms. And So there shouldn't be any pain in the knee here. Right, so no tension or pain in the knee. And for our final version, looking up here. Can work on that one too. <laughs> okay, I hope you enjoy it and I hope it helps you. Just make sure that you don't have any pain or tension in the knee for these poses. If you do, just maybe work on the very first one and see how that goes. And after a while, um, the other ones would work too. Okay, thank you.